This is Kanye West. You may know him as the guy who interrupted Taylor Swift at the VMAs, the guy who married Kim Kardashian, or the dude President Obama called a jackass. He's a jackass. <laughs> Nonetheless, you're probably asking, why are you showing me Kanye West? That's because my response to Walt Whitman these first couple weeks begs the question, is Walt Whitman the Kanye West of early American pop culture? This is a thought that came up to me during our visit to the fifth floor when we were able to see a bunch of Whitman's works in physical form. We learned that Whitman was really unconventional in the way he cared about the book shape, size, and cover designs. The most memorable thing was the fact that he changed the image of himself in two different versions of the same book just to make his crotch area look slightly bigger. Similarly, he was known for making multiple edits throughout his life to different versions of the same poem. Pretty strange in my opinion. But those oddities reminded me of Kanye West, who I'm a rather big fan of. Similar to Whitman, Kanye released an album, 2016's The Life of Pablo, to streaming platforms and then made modifications after it was already released. Throughout the course of the year, he continued to make slight modifications to certain songs, even splitting a single song into two separate tracks. With that in mind, I created this, for our assignment creating a cover for Leaves of Grass. It's essentially an emulation of Kanye West's The Life of Pablo album cover. While working on this, I could only keep thinking of parallels between the two figures. I couldn't help but think of how similar they were in their sense of self-importance. Whitman with his repetition of eyes, Kanye using his controversial Twitter page as a giant sign that says, look at me. Whitman saying he's something magnificent, something grand, and Kanye making his own similar proclamations. When someone comes up and says something like, I am a god, everybody says, who does he think he is? I just told you who I thought I was, a god. At the end of the day, I feel like both of these guys are guys who know that they're great at their craft and have powerful personalities. But just like people like to poke fun at Kanye's arrogance in today's media, I found a kind of humorous side in working on our Whitman imitation writings. So this is something I wrote up after our visit to the city after we visited the library when we walked around outside and I think to the untrained eye it's pretty similar to Whitman and this is the guideline I made for myself to follow to help me with this. All jokes aside I feel that the sense of arrogance between both these guys hints at something greater. These guys are geniuses when it comes to their respective crafts and their works can back that statement up. As someone who is interested in celebrity culture, I just find it interesting that Whitman maybe could have had a Kanye-like reputation as a creative in early America.